Bonjour! My name is Shikha Nair and I welcome you all to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I will be solving the lesson number 1 of a Prunel of Francais method 1 book, which is going to be really really easy. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So let's begin. So we are going to do the lesson number one of a Pranel of Francais method one book. So let's see what's the name of the lesson. So the name of the lesson is Les Salutations. What is it? Les Salutations. Now what does this mean? It means the greetings. So let's firstly see what we are going to learn in lesson number one. In lesson one, we are going to learn les salutations. That means we will be learning the formal and the informal greetings in French. Les salutations and formal, that is informal greetings. Then we will be learning a prono à prendre congé. That means the different ways of saying goodbye. And we will be learning le vocabulaire, that is the vocabulary. So let's firstly see what's the first page of the lesson. So this is the first page of the lesson. Now before reading out the text written on the first page, let's learn the greetings in French. So to greetings we say les salutations. Now before starting with the greetings, let me tell you that in French there are two ways of greeting people. Which are those two ways? The first way is known as formal way that means that is a formal way that we use with our elders where we have to show some respect and the second one is an informal way that is an informal way that we use with our friends where we don't have any formality so let's see so let's see how to say hi or hello to our friends as well as to our elders so if i want to say hi or hello to my friends i would say it as salut S-A-L-U-T is the word, but we are not going to pronounce the T at the last. I would say salut. What if I want to say good morning or hello to someone elder to me? Then I'm going to say it as bonjour. 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 Listen to my pronunciation. I'm not saying bonjour. It is bonjour. The R sound stays in my tongue only. Let's move ahead. Now let's learn how to ask what is your name both in a formal way as well as in an informal way. So if I want to ask what is your name in a formal way, I would say it as vous vous appelez como. Vous vous zaple como. And if I want to ask in an informal way, I would say it as como tu t'appelles. Como tu t'appelles. Vous vous appelez como is a formal way of asking what is your name. Como tu t'appelles is an informal way of asking what is your name. Now if I want to answer to this question, that is, if I want to say my name is, how I'm going to say that in French, I would say it as je m'appelle and my name. So if I want to say my name is Shikha, I'm going to say that je m'appelle Shikha. Let's move ahead. Now how we say and you in French language? So if I want to say and you in a formal way, I would say it as et vous. If I want to say and you in an informal way, I would say it as et toi. Et vous is a formal way. Et toi is an informal way. Let's move ahead. Now if I want to say sir in French, how we say? Sir in French. To sir we say Monsieur, 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 and ma'am is Madame, Ma, Dam, Madame, Monsieur, Sir, Madame, Ma'am. So let's read out the text that is written on the first page. So the first dialogue, the voice says Salut, and the other word replies. Salut, je m'appelle Manuel. So the name of this boy is Manuel. And he says, Et toi, that means I knew. Como tu t'appelles? What is your name? So he says, Je m'appelle Anish. That means my, is, my name is Anish. Next one. So the sir says, Bonjour, madame. And the lady replies, Bonjour, monsieur. Then sir says, Excusez-moi, that means excuse me. Vous vous appelez Como, that means what is your name? And the madame replies, 
Je m'appelle Sophie Delpa. That means my name is Sophie Delpa. Et vous? Et vous means and you? And the sir replies, Je m'appelle Jean Martin. That means my name is Jean Martin. Now let's move ahead. Now let's learn the different ways of greeting people in French. That is, Como salue. So you can greet the people by saying bonjour. That means good morning or hello. Or you can either say, you can say enchanté. Enchanté means nice to meet you. Then we have is either you can say salut. Salut means hi but in an informal way. Or you can say bonsoir. Bonsoir means good evening. Or either you can greet the people by saying bon après-midi. Bon après-midi means good afternoon. Or you can say bienvenue. Bienvenue means welcome. Now let's read out the text that is given on the next page. But before that, let's learn how to ask how are you in French also. So if I want to say hi, how are you in a formal way, I would say it as Bonjour, como allez-vous? Here I'm joining the sound of T and A and I'm saying Bonjour, como allez-vous? That means hi, how are you? What if I want to ask the same thing in an informal way? Then I would say it as Salut, como ça va? That means hi, how are you? So if you want to say how are you in a formal way, you will say como allez-vous? And if you want to say how are you, how are you in an informal way, then you will say como ça va? So let's read out the text that is given on the next page. So it's written bonjour, that means good morning or hello. Enchanté, nice to meet you. Como ça va? How are you? Salut, hi. Bonsoir, good evening. Bon après-midi, good afternoon. Bienvenue, welcome. So here and underneath they have given conversation and formal. Conversation formal. That means informal conversation and formal conversation. So in conversation and formal, how you uh, how you greet each other by saying salut, como ça va? That means hi, how are you? And in conversation formal, you will say bonjour, como allez-vous? That means hello, how are you? Let's move ahead. Now let's learn the different replies of como ça va? That means how you can reply to como ça va, that is how are you in French. So either you can say ça va, that means I'm okay. Or either you can say ça va bien, that means I'm good. Either you can reply ça va bien, merci, that means I'm good, thank you. Or you can say pas mal, pas mal means not bad. Or you can say comme si comme ça. That means I am okay, okay, or I am so so. Or either you can say sava mal. That means I'm not feeling well or I'm not good today. So let's see the different ways of saying goodbye in French language. Now, how you can say goodbye in French language? So either you can say it as au revoir. So au revoir is the most formal way of saying goodbye in French. That means goodbye. Then either you can say Adama. Adama means see you tomorrow. Or you can say Abianto. Abianto means see you soon. Or you can say Atutalar. Atutalar, see you in some time or see you very soon. So let's see what is written on the next page. So it's written Aprano a répondre aux salutations. That means let us learn to reply to the greeting that is Komusawa. So it's written Sava, that means I'm okay. Sava bia, I'm good. Sava bia, merci, I'm good, thank you. Pamal, not bad. Komsi komsa, that means I'm okay, okay. Here there's a mistake in the spelling C. Here it has to be C I, it's written S I. So do correct it, correct it if it's given in your book also. Then it's given Sava mal, that means I'm not well today. Next, it's given a prono, a prendre conge. That means let us learn to say goodbye. So we learned it. That is au revoir. That means goodbye. A bientôt. See you soon. A tout à l'heure. 
see you in some time or see you very soon then they have given her bon soirée bon soirée means have a good evening bon journée bon journée have a good day bon nuit bon nuit is good night adama adama see you tomorrow bon après midi bon après midi good afternoon and then is aputat aputat that means see you later so let's move ahead so on the next page they have given some uh, greetings that you can use it in your daily life for example if you want to say excuse me ma'am how you going to say that you will say excusez moi madame excusez moi that means excuse me madame that is ma'am and how the ma'am is going to reply so the ma'am will say entre that means enter s'il te plaît s'il te plaît means please enter please then if you want to say pardon me sir so you will say it as pardonnez moi monsieur pardonnez moi monsieur that means pardon me sir and the sir can reply de rien je t'en prie de rien je t'en prie that means it doesn't matter then if you want to say please papa so how are you going to say that in french you would say s'il vous plaît papa s'il vous plaît that also means please papa is papa s'il vous plaît papa please papa so if you want to say sorry in french how are you going to say that you would say it as désolé désolé that means sorry and if you want to say that it's okay you will say ah ça va that means it's okay so if you want to say that thank you very much how are you going to say that in french you will say merci beaucoup merci beaucoup that means thank you very much and you want to say that it doesn't matter at all so how you will say that you will say il n'y a pas de quoi il n'y a pas de quoi it doesn't matter at all so on the next page they have given the conversation or you can say they have given some dialogues so it's written lisez ces dialogues conversation informel so the first dialogue is an informal conversation so it's written harry says salut ron says salut comment tu t'appelles so harry says hi ron says hi comment tu t'appelles that means what is your name harry replies je m'appelle harry potter et toi that means my name is harry potter and you ron says je m'appelle ron that means my name is ron then the dialogue two they have given conversation formal so professor says bonjour manuel that means good morning manuel and manuel says bonjour monsieur that means good morning sir comment vous appelez vous that means what is your name and the professor replies je m'appelle jean martin that means my name is jean martin manuel says au revoir monsieur that means good my sir and professor says au revoir manuel that means goodbye manuel then they have given a conversation that is happening in the class so there's a conversation between the boy and the girl so the boy say the girl says salut ça va and the boy replies ça va et toi now boy is calling the girl he is saying salut caroline that means hi caroline then the girl says bonjour monsieur and the sir replies bonjour sara comment allez-vous that means good morning sara how are you and the girl replies bien et vous that means good and you i hope all the text was clear to you now on the next page it's written écoutez et associez les désigns qui correspondent au dialogue so in this you have to listen to me and you have to tell me that the dialogue is related with the which picture so first dialogue i say is that bonjour monsieur comment allez-vous bien merci mademoiselle carta et vous so this dialogue is related with the which picture that is with the third picture So write down number one there. Then listen to my second dialogue. I say it as Salut Claudine, Salut Jean, ça va? So this dialogue is related with which picture? That is the first one. So now listen to the last dialogue. I say Au revoir Jules, à tout à l'heure. Au revoir maman. So that dialogue is related with the 
मिडल पिक्चर सो राइट ऑन नंबर थ्री दिया नेक्स्ट इट्स गिवन एकुते एशांते दैट मींस लिसन एंड सिंग सो दे हैव गिवन अ पोम दैट इज सेम एज दैट ऑफ द पोम दैट यू माइट हैव हर्ड इन इंग्लिश दैट इज आर यू स्लीपिंग ब्रदर जॉन सो हियर इंस्टेड ऑफ सेइंग ब्रदर जॉन दे हैव गिवन द नेम फ्रेर शाक जॉन इज चेंज्ड टू शाक सो इट्स रिटन फ्रेर शाक फ्रेर शाक दैट मींस ब्रदर शाक ब्रदर शाक डॉर्मे वू डॉर्मे वू आर यू स्लीपिंग आर यू स्लीपिंग सोने ले माता सोने ले माता मॉर्निंग बेल्स आर रिंगिंग मॉर्निंग बेल्स आर रिंगिंग डिंग डिंग डोंग डिंग डिंग डोंग नाउ लेट्स मूव अहेड सो वी आर जस्ट लेफ्ट विद द वोकैबुलरी ऑफ दिस दिस लेसन सो द वोकैबुलरी इज गिवन सो द फर्स्ट वर्ड इट्स गिवन सो यू आल्सो ट्राई टू रिपीट आफ्टर मी इट्स रिटन सैल्यूटेशन दैट्स ग्रीटिंग अ बियांतो सी यू सून बोंजू गुड मॉर्निंग और हेलो बोन नुई Good night. Bonsoir. Good evening. Ça va bien. Merci à toi. Fine, thank you. And you? Comment allez-vous? How are you? Comment ça va? How are you? Comment tu t'appelles? What is your name in an informal way? Comment vous appelez-vous? What is your name in a formal way? À demain. See you tomorrow. Dormez-vous? Are you sleeping? Et vous? And you? You fear a girl, frère, brother, a garçon, boy, madame, ma'am, mesdame, plural of ma'am, mademoiselle, miss, mesdemoiselles, plural of miss, monsieur, sir, monsieur, plural of sir. Now, next it's given. Au revoir. Goodbye. Salut. Hello or hi. Sonili mata, ring the bells. S'il vous plaît, please. Bienvenue. Welcome. Enchanté. Delighted or nice to meet you. Ça va mal. Not good. Pas mal. Not bad. Comme si comme ça. So so or okay okay. Au revoir. Goodbye. A tout à l'heure. See you very soon. A bientôt. See you soon. Bon soir. Good evening. Bon après-midi. Good afternoon. Pardonnez-moi. Pardon me. Excusez-moi. Excuse me. De rien. It's nothing or doesn't matter. Je t'en prie. It's okay. I forgive you. Désolé. Sorry. Il n'y a pas de quoi. It doesn't matter or you're most welcome. Merci beaucoup. Thanks a lot. Bonne journée. Have a nice day. Bon soir, have a nice evening and bon après-midi, have a nice afternoon. So with this, we have completed the lesson number 1 of a Prolo Français method fun book. So that was all for today. I hope all the concepts were clear to you and they were very very easy as well. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it by clicking on the bell icon. And don't you forget to give your likes and your comments on my videos as well. because your appreciation is the key to my motivation so till the time i post my next video au revoir and a bientôt and you know it very well what does au revoir means au revoir means goodbye and a bientôt means see you soon